Ouch. I had the heel bones on the back of his foot. Oh, God. On the back, like on, on his heel. heel. On his Achilles? No. Oh. He should put an arrow. Kenny Bo, don't arrow. do it, Kenny Bo. <laughs> um, I'm doing like like the mariachi kind of skull looking dude. So we have like a mariachi dude with the skull and um, <laughs> a guitar and a rose and stuff. On his I already did his upper arm, so we're just building off of what we have on his upper arm. It'll be pretty cool. You have any tats today? No tats? No, I'm doing uh, Lady Liberty. Who's that? <laughs> My mama? Yo, mama. Who, mama? Yo, mama. No, that's your mama. Probably is. She looks more like you. <laughs> <laughs> that's racist. I'm too Asian. <laughs> I'm too Asian to look like her. <laughs> what about you, Jess? You have any tats? Yeah, Kenny, my guy. Ooh. Kenny. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Kenny Bo and Kimmy Bo. Doing a Lady Liberty, Lady Justice, but he wants me to add a M4A1 in her hand and the scale, so I'm trying to, I don't even know if there's enough room, honestly. And the, what? And the like little balance scales, but it's That's just in the inside bicep. That's a lot. It's a lot. And then I have a single day, I'm like, bro, it turned from such a simpler track to something bigger, which is fine. I just have one day, so I won't be able to do it all. Yeah, and I have a single day on this, and it's just a forearm piece, but I told him the same thing. I told him, I was like, look, I might not even be able to finish this on another day, because I don't know. I'm not trying to do that. If my client has skinnier arms, I would. He's got some big, big muscular, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. A little, a little hubby. A little hubby, bubby. A little hubby, bubby. That's what's up. What do you know about hubby, bubby? I don't know her. <laughs> or not. <laughs> what about you? <laughs> what you know about it? Or not. <laughs> she know about it. What do I know about what? Hubby, bubby? Yeah. It's my boy right here. Hubby, oh. bubby. So if I'm doing two hands, it's like... That's not gonna proportionally look right. But yeah, two hands, the gun. Uh, Bro, wait, wait, wait. So he wants two hands with the balance thingies, a gun, and a face. A gun, on his, in, in a bicep? He sent me this this morning. He sent me this Stop. this morning. Because I was just gonna do the Lady Liberty face and then maybe have like the hand popping out with the scales. Easy, you know? Yeah. Like any way you can add her holding an F4A one and then have the smoke coming out like this. Mm. And it's like, to have the smoke, uh, I mean, I got the smoke coming out at a different angle, it just won't look like that. Yeah, or you can do the jump already, but that's what you have to. I have a reference, but. Of it pointed like that? <sighs> like in the front of the gun type shit? Almost. Oh, that's kind of tight. But yeah, I was going to make all that fit. Uh, With the other hand holding the scales, you know? Well, free hand, free stop? Fuck yeah. Bones on his foot. Oh, you're touching? Are you touching it up? We're gonna touch up his foot and then add like the heel bones on the back. Ouch. Add the heel bones on the back of his foot. Oh God! On the back, like on, on his heel. heel. On his Achilles? No. Oh, you should put an arrow. Kenny Bo, don't do it, Kenny Bo. <laughs> uh, oh. Hold the bone. Dude, he's and gonna crack off him. himself. Wait, why he came up with that though? Hey, what? Why? Yeah. Well, just because he has his um, skeleton foot already, and mm -hmm. we're just gonna like wrap it around the back and like make it all just really full around. Mm -hmm. Is he coming to the convention? Yeah. Fuck yeah. Hello. <laughs> what are we doing today? We're doing some color. We're doing Ooh. an anime tattoo. Here's a Demon Slayer. Oh, I know. Yeah. yeah you know Demon Slayer? That was yeah. a popular one. That's Nezuko, right? Yeah, it's Nezuko. And then the de this other evil demon is uh, Daki. Mm. But yeah, I'm so excited. We started this yesterday. We did the line work and then like some of the block yesterday. Mm -hmm. So today we're adding in uh, color. Did you watch the fourth season? I'm pretty caught up. I think I think I am behind like two episodes or something. Mm -hmm. Other than that, I'm caught up. And I've read the uh, manga all the way through, so I know how it ends. Oh. Yeah. I haven't read the manga yet. It gets it's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I'm excited to like see everything uh, animated. You know. Mm -hmm. 
live through the trauma all over again. <laughs> Do you think the manga is better or the anime is better? Honestly, it's so, like they're so, the anime is so close to the manga. I They're both pretty neck and neck, you mm -hmm. know? They did a, the animators did a really good job keeping close, uh, pretty much exactly to the manga, so. Have you watched Spirited Away? Yeah. That's another popular one, mm -hmm. I like that one a lot. I actually have a, a, a no face tattoo. <gasps> That's my it needs favorite to be touched, character too. It needs to be touched up though, because this is one of my first tattoos. And I don't know if you've seen Princess Mononoke, but the wolf, and then the mask oh. from Princess Mononoke. Yeah, I love that movie too. Classic. Yeah. Did you watch it, like all of his movie? I've watched the majority, uh, the majority of them. I haven't seen all of them yet. Mm. Why are you chatting today? I'm touching uh, Spider-Man. Is it on yeah. the forearm? Yep. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm excited for this one. I've been wanting to do it for a while. Mm. It looks fun. I'm excited. I know, it looks so fun. I can't mm -hmm. wait to do it. Um, okay. I just got back from vacation. I went and visited my sister out, and she lives in Missouri. Mm. And so we went out there, visited her, the whole family went. And so yeah, I'm just coming back, trying to transition back into work mode. Work mode. <laughs> Yeah, I'm doing all the color right now. Right now I'm doing like some of the, the grays and stuff like in the hair. Mm -hmm. And then I'll move on to some of the other colors. So when adding colors, do you like add darker color first and then? Yeah, I try to work dark to light. I usually do colors like, um, <laughs> I usually do like colors like yellow and orange. I tend to do last mm. just because they're super vibrant. Mm -hmm. I don't want it like darken it if I use like a darker color after, you know? I don't like mm. stain it a little bit. Mm -hmm. I don't think it'll really affect the tattoo, but still, it's like, I'd rather, if working dark to light works best for me. How are you? Hey, how are you? Good, good. What are we doing today? Uh, we're going to uh, touch up this skeleton foot. Oh. So yeah, we got this done back in uh, November of last year, mm -hmm. November, December. And so, uh, yeah, I'm just going to touch it up. Did it hurt? Uh, yeah. Was it hurt? <laughs> It I, looks painful. Even uh, because um, the skin's so thin, mm -hmm. even if you put numbing cream, it doesn't really work. Especially also like around the knee and chin, if you put numbing cream, it doesn't really affect it. Mm -hmm. This is mainly for like more of the fleshier part, so uh, mm -hmm. yeah, it's gonna be a day for sure. And then you're gonna go through that pain. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay, you're strong. For sure. <laughs> yeah. What about um, this part of your kneecap? Like, are you thinking of doing yeah, anything? Yeah, we're gonna do this later on. This, this uh, upper part. Um, yeah, eventually. Do something that like you want to do as an artist, but then also give the client what they want. Mm. That's probably the most difficult part. But when the clients are open and they give you a good idea to work off, it's pretty easy to design something mm. for them. Yeah. What about you? Same answer. Or stenciling. <laughs> stenciling does suck. I hate stenciling. Stenciling is pretty shit. But it's mandatory though. Man, bro. The mandatory I just step. What is like for the design that you know, like you have a time before you meet up with your client on the date? There's like a time before that you start working on the design. 
if I had time to do that, yeah. But I don't got time to do that. Cause usually I'm already tattooing. And, and then it's like, what, do we charge for that too? Like, yeah. What would you prefer though? Like have, all, have the whole design put together and then just add the last touch or have your client come early on the day that they book and then just really sit down and then, you know, like, I mean, so I kinda put like, the whole idea and just put, put it all together. Like one session. And then all you do is just like, you know, coming up with ideas and putting the design yeah. together. I personally would rather have my design like pretty much fully complete the night before and approved by my client. That way when I come in in the morning, it's already done and I already know what I'm tied to. Mm. But sometimes it is more beneficial to have them in here in person mm -hmm. and talk to them in person because you can it's just easier to explain things to them and to show them certain things. Mm. Yeah, I'd prefer to have my design ready, but it's hard for me to design at home. <laughs> yeah, you've been saying that. I mean, I'll do like most of it, and then I'll come here and just get the little finishing touches. That's what you do, mm. I do. Like last touch? Last touch. But there'll be times where I'll do the whole design and like stencil it too, and I'll come here like ready, but I don't know. When I'm off, I try to, I spend a lot of more time like designing kind of in my head, just trying to picture how I like, envision it. Mm -hmm. And then I get all the photos and stuff and then I'll put it together. Sometimes I'll change it though, because I get all the references and then I'll just keep kind of think on it. Like sometimes I get anxiety, bro. Like trying to design, like damn, I could do it this way, or I could do it this way. There's a lot of different. I'll yeah. have like five different uh, references. I'm like, man, I want to use all of these. Mm -hmm. But really, it's just what flows the best. It's whatever other um, kind of accents you're gonna do. Mm. A body part. Yeah, you go where? Feel bad for what I'm doing. He looks like he's going through it, but he's like, yeah. <laughs> you got this. You got this. <laughs> what do you think that? What do you think so? Because like, there's a lot of nerves. A lot of nerves. Mm -hmm. Mm. So like it's next to the bone and then mm. So as if if she goes deep enough, you can feel it in your bone too, or no? Especially like around nails too, like fingernails, mm. toenails, like. So I guess like hand tattoo, like the the palm, the hand oh, is yeah. like the same thing. Palms really bad, yeah. Oh shit, Jack. <laughs> Jack. I brought the stick. Oh, thank God. No, you needed it. I need that shit. I'll do it to you right now. I was about to fight somebody. <laughs> who, who are you gonna fight? <laughs> Tessa? <laughs> oh god. Alright. She would have won for sure. Yeah, come on. Bro, oh my god. I didn't know that's what you guys were doing today. <laughs> oh, good. Uh, that's painful to watch. Hi, guys. Hey. This one last. And then I did this. I didn't do this. I don't know who did that. Who did this? Uh, just one of my boys over there in Richmond. Shout out to the boy in Richmond. <laughs> uh, how did you come up with the um, ideas and the topic? Um, I just from watching Demon Slayer, mm. and I just like the scene with them two fighting. So, mm. yeah. Is Nezuko your favorite character? Um, yeah, she's definitely one of my favorite characters. Mm -hmm. And then seeing uh, seeing your all your tattoos, you're probably like a big anime fan. Yeah, Crystal I know Inuyasha. Crystal did all of these. Yeah. All of those. Yeah. Ooh. 
Yeah, I definitely I like Inuyasha is one of my favorites. Yeah, I grew up with it. Yeah. <laughs> I grew up with it. <laughs> what else? Like, uh, what else do you have as a, like, anime tattoo? Um, Crystal did this, too. I don't have any other anime, just these ones. Mm. But, yeah, Crystal did that as well. Oh. Yeah. Ooh, it looks nice. Yes. Is it kind of like favorites. a Mother Nature theme? Yeah, it's like, a, it has my Zodiac sign, a Taurus. Mm. Yeah, she posted this on her page, and I really liked it. Oh. <laughs> and then on this piece now. Yeah. We're gonna do more up here eventually too, more Demon Slayer. Oh. But yeah, so far this is what we're starting with. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How you like it so far? I love it. She always does really good work. Mm -hmm. did, did you mention like you want to do it color? Or, like, yes, yeah. Do you recommend I always it? like my anime tattoos color. Mm -hmm. I just feel like it brings out the scene, makes it pop. Mm. Is there any other anime that you watched and then you want to um, like, get a tattoo? Not so far that I want to get tattooed yet, but um, I do want to get a Junji Ito tattoo. Mm -hmm. You know, he writes the horror manga. Oh. Yeah, mm. so I want to get something like that too. Mm. Interesting. Thank you so much for sharing. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. How would you rate the pain? Um, probably like a seven. Yeah. Seven over ten? Yeah. It's not bad. Yeah. Stay cool. Oh. Alright. There you guys. Have fun. Have a good day. Peace out. <laughs>